cat a wallcaper. With a twitch of his tail and a purposeful paw, down by the river crept Scarface Claw. He woke up a lizard, he startled a bee, he bothered a blackbird high up in the tree. Higher and higher he sneakily snuck, but up in the branches he suddenly stuck. Row! he yelled. Harry McCleary was eating his meal, jelly meat, biscuits, a snippet of veal. All of a sudden he heard a strange sound, a yelling, a wailing that echoed around. Row! Yep, 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 said Harry McCleary, and off he went. Hercules Morse was asleep in the glade, with his tail in the sun and his head in the shade. Then came the sound that echoed around. Row! Woof, said Hercules Morse, and off he went. Bottomley Potts was rolling about, with his feet in the air and his tongue hanging out. Then came the sound that echoed around. Row! Woo! said Bottomley Potts, and off he went. Muffin McClay was having a bath in the old wooden tub at the side of the path. Then came the sound that echoed around. Row! Woof, woof! said Muffin McClay, and off he went. Bits of Maloney was having a scratch as he lay in the sun in the strawberry patch. Then came the sound that echoed around. Row! Boo, 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 said Bits of Maloney, and off he went. Snitzel von Klum, Crum was digging a hole in his favourite spot by the passion fruit pole. Then came the sound that echoed around. Row! Yip, yip, said Snipsel von Crum, and off he went. Puffing and painting, impatient to see, together they came to the foot of the tree. They sniffed and they snuffled, they bustled around, and they saw what was making the terrible sound. Yip, yip, said Snipsel von Crum. Boo, woo, 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 said Bits of Maloney. Woof, woof, said Muffin McClay. Woo, 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 said Bottomley Potts. Woof, said Hercules Morse. Yep, 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 said Harry McCleary. And Row! said Scarface Claw. The din was so awful that uphill and down, you could hear the cacophony all over town. Miss Plum brought a ladder and she climbed up the tree. She rescued old Scarface, and at last he was free. With a flick of his tail and a shake of each paw, off at a gallop went Scarface Claw. And back to their business at Donaldson's Dairy went all of the others with Harry McCleary. <laughs>